it's it's very important to remember who who exactly Andy McCabe is and why why it's important that he goes down. Right? My name is Marcus Conti, investigative journalist, sole plaintiff in Conti vs. DSNY, case 1010582016. So we just saw Andy McCabe. I know it's it's a maybe a day late or a few hours late, but Andy McCabe was just cut, um, fired, terminated from employment a few hours before his uh, self-declared retirement. He was going to squeak into retirement and capture his full pay, and uh, once he's retired, he's pretty much immune to anything he did before, right? He vests, his, his pension is vested. That's what they do. They sneak out the back door. That's what he's trying to do. He's trying to get out. He's trying to run the clock out and uh, get out. Now, who is Andy McCabe, right? Oh, yeah, the, the Post and the news and mainstream media spinning it as Trump's whipping boy, right? McCabe, Trump, McCabe fired because he, because he was, he was against Trump and, and the, the Mueller probe, right? Mueller probe was, a, was, is a farce anyway. It's a farce to cover up. It's a fake Russia story that the Democrats invented, right? So it's, it's pretty thick. Andy McCabe is instrumental in the Clinton, uh, cover up. Right? It's 2016 election, right? the PP dossier that they tried to pin on, on Trump. Right? Andy McCabe's wife took a sum, I don't know, what was it, like $700,000 when his wife took money from the Clinton Foundation, Clintons, when his wife ran for a congresswoman and lost. Andy McCabe is is uh, is implicated all over the Clinton scandal. He's the he was momentarily the FBI director after um, after Coma uh, Comey, <laughs> Comey got fired, right? Right, and they're complaining. That's that's it. That's all they get. He loses his money. The guy should be in jail. There's also parts of that story that why, if you really look at Andy McCabe, you'll realize that he was also heavily involved with uh, investigating Russian oligarchs. The reason why they came up with the Russia story was that McCabe is instrumental in creating the narrative that somehow Russia is guilty of, you know, of of getting involved in in our elections, which no proof to the state has ever been shown. No proof will ever be shown. It's because it's a made up story. It's it's the it's Bill Clinton and Hillary Clinton at their finest. They tell a story. They have power. They tell a story, and everybody's expected to fall in line. Right? So you know why? Again, so Andy McCabe is is down. That's a good thing. Right, there should be others. It's a it's a warning shot, you know. It's a it's a it's a warning shot. Jeff Sessions, the attorney general, finally did his job. But um, you know, it's a twisted situation. I think that uh, you know McCabe is a is a is a bad guy. You know, bad guy. Wow, gotcha.